Right, it's another rainy day today. Um, weather forecast said it was going to be sunny, um, but it's been raining non stop for the last three hours. So um, I'm still going to get the bus to the coast. I'm just hoping, really hoping, um, that it's not raining there, basically, because this place is just. It's, it's just rained literally almost for the last 24 hours constantly now since I arrived here. So I can't wait to get out of here. Um, and I want to be somewhere that's not raining where I can, um, you know, get on my bike and start cycling because I'm not cycling in the rain again, uh, which I've done a couple of times now. And uh, it's made me feel pretty awful afterwards so yeah not putting myself through that again um, but yeah it still could stop but it doesn't sound like it's going to it sounds pretty constant um, yeah we'll see when I get to the coast anyway I don't know what it is about this country, or my luck or what, but um, I started about 15 minutes ago and it was clear, sunny, nice conditions. Within about five minutes, a massive fog bank of freezing cold air just came off the sea. It's so really cold, my nose feels like it's going to fall off. and. Having no wind, for the first three minutes, I've now got a pretty strong wind in my face again, blowing directly in my face like it always does. Doesn't matter what direction I'm heading in, seriously, the wind is always the other way. I don't know why. And it slowed me right down. It's basically half the speed that I'm going at, so if you... Again, if you go half the speed, it takes twice as long, so... Oh, God. So it dies down a bit. Well, once again, the weather's timed itself to absolute perfection. I am soaking. Everything was absolutely nice. Clear sunny when I got off the bus. Five minutes into my ride, I'm soaked. Uh, if I'm going uphill or into the wind, I'm going slowly. It's cold. It's kind of wet. If I go downhill and pick up speed, this fog is actually more like a very fine rain. So the faster I go, the more wet I get. It's crap. I can't even see a lot either. So, oh, I hope it doesn't carry on too long because if that's the case, I'll be putting on wet cycling stuff tomorrow. I'm going through the whole annoying business of trying to dry stuff out in a two man tent with loads of luggage in it. And that's not good. Anyway, we'll see what happens. You know, it could change for the better. Does. Nice looking waterfall there, pretty big. Um, I think there's, there must be some nice looking scenery around me. Uh, I get sort of little hints of it, you know, like that there. Um, the cliffs look like they could be interesting, but I just can't see enough of them to really tell. Um, it's a shame. Uh, 
it's all kind of hidden. It's clouded in mist, and so is my face, and uh, it's all collecting in my beard as well. So I don't even really need to, you know, um, reach down for my water bottle because I can just it's just sort of dripping into my mouth from uh, from my beard. So you know, saving time in that respect. But yeah, I'm looking forward to getting to where I'm going to. Yeah, definitely. All right, we've got the beautiful warm sunshine now, nice and bright, and warm and hot, actually. Hot more than warm on a bike. Um, so, cruising. About halfway now. Probably a couple of hours to go, something like that, I reckon. Maybe more, maybe less, you never know what can happen really.